Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Valentin and today I'm gonna I'm gonna share with you my recipe for sea bream and steam broccoli. And for this we're gonna need the next ingredients. I have here uh, a sea bream who is like 400 500 grams. Uh, we have 50 grams of cherry tomato, 100 grams of broccoli, a little bit of fresh thyme, a little bit of fresh parsley, three small cubes of butter, half of fresh chili cut. Uh, also, we're gonna need a bit of lemon, salt, pepper, olive oil, and uh, 30 grams of pine nuts and peanuts. First thing, I'm gonna show you how to prep the sebrim. I just show you how to fillet the fish. Uh, I, I season it now with salt and pepper, and now I will show you how to cook a perfect broccoli. To cook the broccoli, you need salted boiling water, and for this you're gonna need the time. You can use your phone or anything else, and you need to put exactly four minutes, and after you will remove it. For the fish, we're gonna need the uh, medium high heat for the pan. One tablespoon of olive oil. Very important when you cook any fish. Make sure the make sure the skin stays straight. I'm going to cook the fish on the skin for five to six minutes. After I will turn it and I will finish it with one small cube of butter and a bit of lemon juice. But after turn it, you don't need to cook it anymore. You need to remove the pan from the fire straight away. Okay, now I'm gonna flip the fish. Remove it from the fire. Now the fish is ready. I'm going to leave it rest and I will prepare the sauce for our sauce. We're gonna start with the pine nuts and peanuts. We need to toast them to get more flavor. Medium heat. We need to constantly mix it to make sure the, the nuts they will not burn. When we see our, our nuts, they start to get brown a little bit. Gonna add the chili. I'm 
a small cube of butter. I'm gonna add it first time. Share it water. Bit more butter. Lemon juice. Bit of olive oil. At the end we're gonna add the parsley and the broccoli back to heat it. A bit more lemon juice. Salt and pepper for seasoning. And the garnish is ready. This is the final result of our dish. This is my sibling with broccoli, pine nuts and peanuts. Thank you very much for watching. See you guys next time.